and welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for some Teemo Wayfinder, going to be our next meme tier deck. Uh, we got four more meme tier donation decks to do today. We're going to get to the Braum Kench that we didn't get to yesterday, plus three other awesome ones, including this one that's all about giving the opponent as many puff caps as possible. We even have, um, so we're going with like a uh, puff cap peddler, lots of puff caps with clump of wumps, chump wump even have shady characters in here so we got some spicy cards in here so shady character um we need to pick a follower and transform me into an exact copy of it that's going to be for the puff cap peddlers so because you know you want to have as many puff cap peddlers in play as you can and so we're playing shady characters to try to copy puff cap peddler okay and then uh some other spicy ones we have we have kinku wayfinder in here which is going to miss half the time we have half ionia half pnz so it's going to miss half the time that's just kind of how it is but if it doesn't miss it gets to put two teemos into play and that will be awesome we also have uh retreat that we can put the kinku wayfinder back into our hand and try again <laughs> if, if we miss so we, we have a um, an option there we also have uh dawn and dusk where if we, you know, if we have a Teemo in play, one Teemo is never enough. We need more Teemo, so we can get two additional copies of Teemos. But this card just works perfectly with all sorts of stuff. We, you can even use this on uh, Kinku Wayfinder <laughs> if you if you want. Um, but then, you know, like Chump Womp can get you more Mushroom Clouds. Shadow Assassin can draw you extra cards. You can get extra Puff Cap Peddlers right before you play a bunch of Mushroom Clouds or something like that. So Dawn and Dusk works pretty well with a lot of the stuff in our deck. And then we got Dragon's Rage, another spicy one at the top end. So this is going to be like our removal spell, of course. Um, but it, it does have the ally does uh, strike both the enemy and the enemy nexus. So that's the, the key here. This is like a Will of Ionia, but we strike the enemy nexus. And that's important, of course, because Teemo. We need Teemo to nexus strike. And if we have a leveled up Teemo, a nexus strike doubles the poison puff caps. So Dragon's Rage can double the poison puff caps in their deck. So that's a pretty spicy one. All right, so let's let's see how this does. We're going to go just play it in, in normal, of course, because it is Meme Tier Monday. We want to be playing against slower decks because the slow decks, um, they don't kill us too fast. And then it gives us more time for all of the puff caps. You know, it gives them more draw steps to draw those uh, puff caps. Okay, so we're going to just start by mulliganing the six and seven mana cards. Yes, Teemo. Nothing like the great outdoors. Go get him, Teemo. So really, I don't want to see Katarina. And there's a possibility that I shouldn't play that this turn to, to save a little bit of mana, so I'd have Deny. Okay, cool, no Katarina. Because Katarina would give them Blade's Edge. Now, we did draw the Retreat, so we would have been fine. That's the problem with Katarina, was the Blade's Edge. Follow the horizon. Ooh, Peddler. All right, so right now they have five Puff Caps. So if I play Peddler, then play Mushroom Cloud, that's an additional eight. And so then I could play a Mystic Shot. So three, four, five, six, which I do have the mana for all of that, and that would level up Teemo. Have a mushroom. Have three. So that sounds good. That's a way to level up Teemo this turn. I definitely don't want Ravenous Flock to kill my Teemo. So we don't get to level up Teemo. We'll still get him in there attacking. Oh no! Hush? That is cheating. Oh, that's so cheating. A poor Teemo. 
Breathe out. All right, so our retreat return did, you know, count as two spells. We get a draggling, good blocker. Warriors of the Raharak, our time is now. We'll follow you to the edge of daybreak. All right, we will impersonate the Puffcat Peddler. Devotion to battle. It's strange that they're attacking. Okay, Shadow Assassin's good. Yes, another Teemo. I won't have Deny available to protect Teemo. I'm gonna play this and pass, see if they spend more mana. Not have mana to kill my Teemo. All right, please no hush. Yes. Double him up. 42. So if I would have cast Mystic Shot first, it would have been an additional 12 puff caps. We'll just hold on to it. No. Um, I'm gonna pass. I want to block with this clump of lumps. Ah, uh, two of them. All right, let's kill this and kill that. Because, of course, these will get the the bonus of the plus plus zero plus four and everything too. Gives him 59 puff caps. Block that, take 10. It's just sleeping, right? We get a draggling. What is gained when we return malevolence? Ooh. <laughs> Seven. I will play my part. Love it. Power before our might. Yeah, deny so good. That was a very good deny. I'm a mushroom. I'm we just gotta draw four. Heard about you. My faith protects me. Alright, let's give him another 18. They grow up so fast. <laughs> Triple peddler. The dark beckons. Let's draw another card. All right, we get four puff caps. There we go, another seven, lucky sevens, and our Teemo Wayfinder starts with a win. We did it together. Okay, uh, good turn three, turn four. Got a couple of those, but this is probably, I mean, I guess this is probably they who endure. Mm. So I do have the attack token turn four. Okay, okay. Please don't kill my Teemo, ever, ever. The thing is, we, we already have a bunch of Ionia cards in hand. But man, if this... Uh, if this Kinku Wayfinder hits, it's going to be pretty awesome. Yeah, it's going to be pretty awesome if this Kinku Wayfinder hits. Want to draw a spell that costs two or less mana? Maybe like a Mystic Shant? Okay, not quite. Oh no. Yeah, that's a that's a heck of a start right there. <laughs> it's turn three. 
What is all this? So I saved two life. Let's see. If I wait till after to play Peddler, we're taking 3, 6, 9, 11. Or I play Peddler first and we take 9. And Peddler takes 2 damage. I guess we have to play Peddler first. That's a 50-50 shot, whether we hit our Allegiance or not. Normally, uh, now we're at four Ionia cards, three PNZ, so it's going to be less than 50-50. If we draw a PNZ card for turn, then it'll go back to 50-50. Okay, so 50-50 shot. I think we just try to hit that. Could go Shady Character on the Peddler, but no, let's, let's try to hit it. Extra hands never hurt. Mm. Did not. The chains! Never stop. We can try again with the Dawn and Dusk on the Kinku Wayfinder. not a big difference between one and two. We're probably dead. They just had a super aggressive start. They grow up so fast. Have a mushroom. Have three. Yeah, they're just looking for another Doom Beast. Maybe I shouldn't have played the Peddler. I guess I shouldn't have. Yeah, I guess I, sh I should not have played the Peddler. Because if this does hit... Okay, that, w that works good. But, they're the Doombies. GG's. I don't like Fiora. Fiora kills my... Uh, kills my Teemo. I don't like that. Yeah, I'm not sure if I, I like our chances with this matchup. This Fiora Shen is just a really, really good deck. I don't like our chances, but we're going to try. Get a mushroom cloud. I think my plan is to. Oh, if mushrooms could talk. They oh, would no. fall by my blade. My plan is to try to give them a whole bunch of pop caps before hitting them with Teemo. Okay. Two worlds, one balance. I fight with my spirit, not my fists. So I go. Yeah, there was a patch update today. Um, no card balance changes. Pay between 3 and 25 characters. Thank you very much. Yeah, the stream is going, going very good. There was a little fella asking for me. So still at zero. That didn't count. What is gained when we return malevolence? So it's basically, do I want... Do I want to copy Puffcat Peddler, or do I want to get more Mushroom Clouds in hand? What do you mean I'm not on the list? <laughs> Alright, get another Peddler. The water changes, but never breaks. It must be done. Try me. You're in over your head. I don't I don't know the exact time of whenever the patch was implemented, I don't know. There's 
no... For me, it, it wasn't while I was playing yesterday, and it is today. I don't know what time it was, though. to hope hope they have no removal and no sharp sight and I also kinku wayfinder and hit two other teamos extra hands never hurt nope well <laughs> so easy yeah their decks a lot better than ours <laughs> It's meme tier day, but they unfortunately are not going to let us let us have too much fun. Give us mushroom clouds. I honestly just don't understand what you're talking about, Jack. How can you say this game is far from balanced? Like, I don't, I honestly have no idea how you could even come to that conclusion. What is gained when we return oh, y'all have been balance. talking about like how. Enforced equilibrium. Try me. I just don't understand how you can come to that conclusion. How can you say this game is not balanced? Balance has been maintained. I have never ever seen a, a, a card game as balanced as this, and it, it's it's honestly with me, it's for me, it's breathtaking how completely balanced this game is throughout you know the hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of cards in the game. It's honestly remarkable. <gasps> I mean, that's that's how you keep it balanced is, is changing cards. But I mean, they didn't have to change any cards this time. Right now, it's perfect. Like right from like the last time that they changed some cards, it it's great right now. Is there anything that you think is too powerful? Like I'm just not I'm not sure I understand. Okay, let's mystic shot them. And uh hope they draw 16 puff caps. 16? Just one. That's not enough. I need to draw 16. What's the name of it? Go hard. Go hard, that's the name of it. Go hard and yeah, go hard and feel the rush are the only two kind of broken cards. That's about it. All right, I don't need you. We don't need to play defense. The big question is, do I want to counterfeit copies Teemo? And I don't... Mm, I'm not sure. I kind of do. Let's try you also. Let's get better stuff. Playing against Deep is really weird when you're playing a puff cap deck because they they are trying to like toss their cards. 
Yeah, I let Valfies kill this. If I didn't have the other Teemo, I would not have played this right here. Like this, and I, I probably shouldn't have anyway. I probably should have just waited for the first Teemo to be a 2 2 anyway. So it's kind of weird because you want to you want to unload a bunch of um, like if I only had one Teemo, I would have played it right there. And I, like I said, I probably just should should have waited anyway. Anyway, if you kind of like want them to toss all their cards first and then after that, then you give them a bunch of puff caps. I will tend this garden. Because you, you want their deck size to be smaller so that they have a, a smaller number of cards, a uh, smaller number of concentration of cards for your puff caps to go on. sure what I want to do with this counterfeit copy use, to be honest. I want more Teemos in the deck. So I want them to keep, like, all these things and, you know, I don't want to, like, so you don't want to block the 1-1s. One you want them to keep the 1-1s one one so that now, <clears throat> whenever they play a new unit, they don't get a, a sapling because they don't have any room. And I want to play this before they could play uh, the five, the the elusive sea, sea monster. Or before they could play like the the six mana four four. Success gets you noticed around here. Have a mushroom. Have three. So I, I the dragon just doesn't matter. I'm just not. Even, I'm not gonna be playing it. Protect our grove. Wow, those those three cards they burned had six puff caps on them. Okay. I'm gonna kill the dead bloom wanderer. <clears throat> I'm not sure if I need to kill if I need to bounce Maokai. Kinda wanna just get rid of this dead bloom wanderer with the lifesteal. This is probably more important. <clears throat> so this, of course, would be Teemo striking the Nexus, doubling their puff caps again. I could, I, you know, I could give them all these before I double, but it's just if this was regular Mushroom Cloud, we would. But this is, it's just kind of risky that in case they get rid of my Teemo, I want to have backup Teemo. But we would have gave them another thirty-four puff caps. So, you know, maybe it would have been worth it. All right, just one card left. I don't think they're going to kill my Teemo with just one card. They haven't shown that they're killing it. All right, so I missed out on 17 extra puff caps. <clears throat> by not playing that first. Wow, that one card had six puff caps. That's twice they play a card that has just tons and tons of puff caps. Okay. 
I could, I could go 18 more puff caps first before I double up if I go retreat first, but it just gives them the opportunity to play Sea Monster Blocker. We'll give them 114 puff caps with 13 cards left. And they want to pass? They want to go to their draw, their next turn to draw? Alright, so you have chosen death. So you have chosen death. All right, two and two. Victory was the mushroom we planted along the way. Thank you so much. All right, play and get some bilge water. Don't need these. Uh, what about deny? It's good against like Tom Kench. Eat your stuff. We'll mulligan it. We need to find, you know, our puff cap peddler and Teemo and that kind of stuff. Puff cap cards. Dawn and Dusk could be pretty cool in this matchup. We get a Teemo and Dawn, Dawn and Dusk, so they're, they're probably not uh, stopping that too much, except for like Hush. Awesome, Z Mads. Glad you're enjoying the Give It All Poro deck. That was from Cabo. Who, uh, you know, message right before you. That was from, from Cabo. All right, no champions. Our Shen Fiora opponent had turn three Shen, turn four Fiora. Or the other way around, sorry. Turn three Fiora, turn four Shen. Hopefully this opponent doesn't do that. Cool. Um. I have to get this Teemo in play before I play the Wayfinder, because otherwise he'll just turn into a Mushroom Cloud. That's gonna kill my Teemo next turn. For Hopefully, we have a lot of Teemos, though. Come on, have lots of Teemos. First step's the hardest. Yes. Let's go. So, Mushroom Cloud will be five. One of these hits will be 10. The other one will be 15. And then this one would double it to 30. Now, hopefully, no hush. More for my collection. I'll scout ahead. It's too bad. Starts with mushrooms. Or at least these will be leveled up now. Success is planting your mushroom crop. Oh no. That's not good. Yeah, the shakedown's pretty rough. Ooh, perfect. Great draw. Start the round. Where are you off to? So they even had a you know, they had hush and they had that shakedown. Couple annoying cards to see, but ooh, there we go, another retreat. Good. Okay, let's see. Next turn, yeah, we just play this. They're, they don't really play removal. Seeing if we want to like wait till we had retreat available. Um, man, I, I need one more mana. I'm sure there's something for my taste. Armed and ready. I guess we just use retreat here. Starts with mushrooms. Yeah, we're gonna have to do that. Osu can sniff out any star anywhere. Silent as death. 
I don't know why they attack with the Shadow Assassin. I kind of forgot about the Shadow Assassin. No, I don't. I don't want Shady character. Ugh. At least, good news is we can't draw any more Shady characters. That's the good news. What? You had your chance to walk away. Not even targeting Teemo? Cool. I don't even have to use my... Uh, my retreat recall now. Appetizers of plenty. Bring the foot and barrel. Let us reconnoitre. Ooh, you wee scruff. Alright, so it's half our life total. We're down to eight. Shady character just unfortunately is just just really really bad here. There's just I just don't want to copy anything because you don't get you don't get the the summon abilities. So you get nothing with these. So unfortunately that was like the only dead card in my deck, and we've drawn all three. I could shady the challenger, but I mean I, I yeah I guess I guess I just have, I guess I have nothing to do honestly. I can maybe challenge the star shepherd. You know like I I don't want to damage their things. That's the thing is like they they usually will save their units, and I don't want to da damage them. At least spend some mana. It's too late now. Nothing like the great outdoors. Where there's a will, there's a me. Okay, okay. Yeah, like, this should work, because then they'll have to replay Tom Kench before they can acquire Taste. I really wish I could play Dawn and Dusk also. I really wish we could add two extra mana. The Order rewards its faithful. So they're up to 60 puff caps now. Tommy boy! We found the other the other useless card besides the shady character. I guess there was one other useless card, I the Dragon. never know what hit him. I I should have stayed home, pal. Where are you off to? Ooh, you wee scruff. Just damages the thing. I'm planning on these Mystic Shots going upstairs and damaging them. I don't want to waste the Mystic Shots on these things. And we could just block these anyway. TK became a VIP. Let's go. <clears throat> 28, 120. They only have one mana left. I could do this and just kill the Tom Kench. Maybe I just do that. They still kill my Teemo the next turn with the challenge with the box to post. All right, what do they have? They have like an average of basically four puff caps per card. But they're healing their Nexus for three with this. Oh, this is this is tough. Allow me a small sample. I drew two, an average of four per card. This is just drawing two. So I got 12 and nine Start the with these. Where are you off to? I've got this. Uh,
Really hope this works. Killing that thing. No. I feel better when you feel better. Gross. That's 16 now. So that's... I guess that's just lethal, actually. Or no, they're at 13? Oh no, that one's at 13. This one's at 16. Well, I guess this one should do it first. That should be 19. And then that one checks. Does it recheck? It doesn't. Alright, good. I guess I need to kill them this turn. I don't they don't get another draw step. Nah, we missed. If we would have hit the Allegiance, we would have got the other Wayfinder and then two Teemos. Man, Shady Character and I the Dragon were terrible for us this game. Just, you know, like this game. It's just kind of a weird game. But then, yeah, just end step, we lose. <clears throat> we just needed spells, basically. You know, like that's... We just needed spells that game and just drew all those units that just didn't matter at all. That was a close game. That was pretty close. Really, if, if those two cards were anything else, you know, Shady Character, just how that matchup plays out, Shady Character and I, the Dragon, were the only two cards that just don't matter in the deck. You know, because even if they were, like, the other units, Clump of Wumps, Chump Wump, Puff Cat Peddler, all of those would have been really nice. So that's too bad. Um, but yeah, so, uh, I guess a two and three with the Super Meme deck is fine. Yeah, not not bad, not bad. I, I think that, uh... I think overall, like that, that's actually probably a pretty good matchup for us. Like, I, I, I would, I think that we'll win more games than not against that deck. They had like the hush. They had you know like the hush for the one Teemo and oh, actually, you know what? I think we were out of Teemos. I forgot about that. We had, we wayfindered earlier and hit. So actually, I think we were out of Teemos. Um, but yeah, they, you know, they had the hush earlier, and then you know like they had the, the challenger was really good, but. Um, Maybe I should have Dawn and Dusk the turn that I Dragon's Raged. If I would have Dawn and Dusk, I would have hit them one. No, it would have been hitting them two times either way. So I guess the Dragon's Rage made sense. Yeah, it would have hit them two times either way. So actually, no, that worked out. But Retreat was perfect for saving Teemo. We used Retreat, save Teemo quite a bit, like save Teemo through Challengers and things like that. Retreat was amazing for us. Um, definitely a big fan of that. Um... The shady characters weren't that great, but there were some times we got to co copy uh, Puff Cat Peddler, and that was really good. But if you're playing a deck like this, just try not to play against the super aggro decks. We saw that we saw them just run us over. I was really impressed with Dragon's Rage, though. Dragon's Rage looked really looked really cool. Like Dragon's Rage Teemo is actually pretty cool. I, I hadn't done that before. Teemo's Rage. Maybe I'll have to make a meme tier deck, um, kind of around those two in the future. Like Teemo's Rage. That was pretty cool. All right, but anyway, those of y'all watching later on YouTube, hit that like button over there. And of course, feel free to leave those comments as well. I'd appreciate that. But thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you for the next video.